Hi there, Senator Vance. Uh, my name is Julia Gorman, reporter for WZZM in Grand Rapids. This is your fifth stop specifically to West Michigan, our side of the state. Just wondering if you can elaborate on why you continue to come back to our area and advocate for your campaign. Well, because I love this part of the state, I love the state of Michigan, and frankly, I feel maybe if I come when it's a little warmer, I won't have to come so much when it's really cold. No, we're going to be here, look, we're going to be here every week, probably me or President Trump until the election, because this is such an important part of our state. And I, you know... And obviously these folks agree, but look, one of the things I love about this area is that it, it, it exemplifies a proud American spirit of craftsmanship, of making things with your hands, of doing things extraordinarily well, and being proud in building a great American product. And you know, one of the things that happened in my hometown is that we decided that we didn't need to make things in the United States of America anymore. That was a, that was a bipartisan decision. It was a bad decision, and the steel mill that employed my grandfather for 40 years went from about 10,000 employees to about 2,000 employees, and it was one of the lucky ones because a lot of those steel mills completely disappeared. I believe that if we've got smart public policies, I believe that if we're drill baby drilling, if we're investing in American energy resources and American workers, if we're penalizing companies that are shipping jobs overseas and rewarding the workers and businesses that are building things right here in the United States of America, Michigan is going to lead a great American manufacturing renaissance, and I want to carry that message to all corners of the state, but especially in Grand Rapids. And so my, my message my message, my message to folks in Western Michigan, but frankly, my message to everybody in the state of Michigan is we can build things in this country again like we've never done before. We can employ middle class American workers doing it, and we're going to make our country so much more self sufficient and so much more powerful when we make more in America, do it with the hands of Michigan workers, and produce broad based prosperity for our people. We can get back to it, we just got to have smarter leadership.